How's it going everyone Hero Gaming and today we're playing Blue's Tower Defense 6. In this episode I'm going to show you how to get this strangely adorable achievement so let's jump right into it. Now for this achievement you're going to need to get Adora as your hero and you're going to go into your monkey knowledge. Now I respect my monkey knowledge for this video. You're going to go into magic and you need to unlock these right here. Okay, and I've invested the minimum I'm allowed to invest into this so that I can unlock there can only be one. I'm going to keep the 118. I'm not going to spend it. I'll spend it after the event, but make sure you got monkey knowledge on and no matter what other monkey knowledge you have, you'll be able to get this. So the first thing you want to do is get into the resort. We're going to be playing this on easy, standard, and let's jump right into it. So we're going to start this off with dropping a boomerang monkey right here. We're going to get long range rings, red hot rings, and get started. And then we're going to get ourselves a buccaneer. The first buccaneer we're going to drop right over here. Try to get as close to the possible to the left. We're going to go grape shot, long range, crow's nest, hot shot. And then we want merchant man. And then we want favored trades. At this point, we're going to go back to the boomerang monkey. We're going to get Kylie boomerang, Moab press. And then we want to set him to strong. And then we're going to start getting ourselves banana farm. So we're going to drop the first one right here. What we're going to do with these is we're going to get long life bananas, valuable bananas, monkey bank, and then easy collect and banana salvage. And then we're going to finally drop a wizard monkey right over here. For this wizard monkey, we're going to get intense magic, monkey sense, fireball, wall of fire, dragon's breath. And then we're going to drop our second banana farm right under this first one. We're going to go down that same path. So long life bananas. It's going to tell you victory round 40. Don't worry about it. Just click free play and let's keep going. Now valuable bananas. Get started. Monkey bank and easy collect and banana salvage. And this is only so we don't have to micromanage them because we're going to have a lot of banks running at the end. On to the third banana farm right here. Same path. One, two, three. Oh, we don't have enough. So all the way to monkey bank and then easy collect and banana salvage. And we're going to keep building them right here. Just keep building them as soon as you can. You just keep clicking until you have enough and keep going. So I made the mistake of going lower. So I'm only going to be able to fit this many here. It's no problem. We're going to keep building them right here in the corner and keep that going. So by round 61, you're going to have around 12K. And at least I think that was 19. No, that's 17 monkey banks. And at this point, you're going to go. You're going to get yourself trade empire for the monkey buccaneer. And then we're going to draw a super monkey right over here for the super monkey we're gonna get laser blast plasma blasts and then we're going to get sun avatar for the super monkey and then we're going to get two more boomerangs so one boomerang right here and then another one just under it now make sure when you're placing them they're still within range of the super monkey for both boomerangs we're going to go improved rings glaive glaive ricochet and more glaives and then same thing for this one right here and then for the wizard we're going to get summon phoenix and then Wizard Lord Phoenix. And then we want Moab Domination for the Boomerang Monkey. And then we want to drop another Buccaneer right over here. Make sure again it's within range of the Super Monkey. We want Faster Shooting, Double Shot, Destroyer, Aircraft Carrier. And then Carrier Flagship. And at this point we're going to be saving up the 85k for the Sun Temple. Now make sure you do not collect your banana farm monkey banks. Here we go by round 82. You're going to have the money. You're going to pay 85k. You're going to do it. And now we only have the other half of the equation left. So what we want to do here is drop Adora. Just try to get her as close as possible with this guy. We're going to leave Adora as is. If you have the monkey knowledge to get her at level 3, she'll start at level 3. I don't, so we're going to start her at level 1. And then we're going to drop a super monkey right here. We're going to go knockback, ultra vision, dark knight, dark champion. And we want to save up to go all the way to legend of the night. But before we do that, we're going to go to all of our banana farms and get IMF loans. So just keep buying IMF loan as you can afford it. Here we go. So we have them all turned into IMF loans. Now you're going to use all the IMF loans you have. And then whenever they come back, just use them. Make sure you don't have any left there. And then we're going to turn to Monkeynomics. Just one of them, of course. You can't do all Monkeynomics. Just make sure you use the Monkeynomics and the IMF loan abilities as soon as you can. And then you're going to go to your Super Monkey and get Knockback Ultra Vision. Just so they can see the camos. Well, eight hey, can see the camos. And then by round 100, you're going to have enough for Legend of Love the Night for the Super Monkey right here. And then you want to drop another Super Monkey right over here. This time we're going to go Super Range, Epic Range. Make sure you're constantly using your IMF loans. Robo Monkey, Tech Terror. And then as you keep collecting your IMF loans and your Monkey Nomics, you're going to very quickly get enough for the Anti Bloon. And as I say that, I take forever to get there. There we go, that's the anti balloon. And now that we have these two planted here, we're going to start rebuilding around this guy. 
So first thing we're going to do is make sure we can fit two subs in this range. So this is one sub. This is a second sub. There we go. They're well within range. For the first sub, we're going to go longer range, advanced intel, submergent support, bluntonium reactor, and then all the way to energizer. And for the second sub, we're going to go barb darts, heat tip darts, longer range, advanced intel, ballistic missile, first strike capability, now again, keep using your RMF loans, don't forget to do those, in the Monkeynomics. And then preemptive strike for that sub. And then we're going to click on the Super Monkey, we're going to find that the range extends well beyond Adora, so we're going to drop a bomb shooter right here. We're going to go bigger bombs, heavy bombs, really big bombs, balloon impact, and then balloon crush. And then we want to set it to strong. Just for fun, we're going to go faster reload missile launcher. And then we want to drop an Alchemist right over here. For the Alchemist, we're going to go Larger Potions, Acid Mixture Dip, Berserker Brew, Stronger Stimulant, and then use the IMF Loans and the Monkeynomics we have. And that'll give us just enough for Permanent Brew, Stronger Acid Perishing Potions just for fun. And then we're going to see if we can fit a Banana Farm. We cannot. In that case, we are going to drop a Monkey Village right over here. Again, making sure everything is within range. We're going to go Grow Blocker, Radar Scanner, Monkey Intelligence Bureau, again using our IMF loans and Monkeynomics upgrades, there we go, we got Call to Arms, and then finally Homeland Defense. Now if you're enjoying these videos, please consider subscribing, I upload every single day, and let's keep on going. Now just for fun, we're gonna get bigger radius and jungle drums for the Monkey Village. And now comes the fun bit where we just wait. So with this, as you're waiting, do not use IMF loan, but definitely use the Monkeynomics upgrade. Now just a side note, with Monkeynomics, I think you're allowed to use it three times per round, and because we have this guy right here, this, these rounds are taking very, very long. And let's keep on going. So by round 135, we're going to have our whole IMF loan paid off. At this point, you're going to have 16 available just to use every single one of them. And then you're going to use Monkeynomics. And that'll take you to a solid 320k. And let's keep on going. Again, keep using Monkeynomics. Do not stop. But let the IMF loans load out. So you're just going to make sure by round 136 that your Adora is level 120. Sorry, 20, not 120. You're going to use then use my... Uh, whatever the economics upgrade here monkeynomics you're gonna take all the remaining IMF loans and that'll take you to so just turn off auto start round 137 and that'll take you to more than enough for the true sun god and then this is what's gonna happen so when we start the round now we're gonna have enough to just sacrifice everything so let's jump right into it do the true sun god and then that true sun god will turn into the vengeful true sun god and that'll take care of Adora as well so we're just gonna let the round play through right now there we go, round 138 is over, we are going to go home, and you should go to your achievements and you should have it, and that's how it's done. I hope you enjoyed the video, have a good one guys.